that 10 Gopher football players facing discipline over sexual assault allegations at the U of M learned the outcome of their appeals today. Four players were expelled, two suspended for a year, and four were cleared by the student panel deciding their academic fate. WCCO's Jennifer Mayerly explains what this means and what happens next. Two days of closed door hearings in front of a three student panel determined if the punishment handed down by the University of Minnesota for 10 suspended Gopher football players would stand. Sources tell WCCO four players were expelled Ray Buford, Keonti Harden, Dior Johnson, and Tamarian Johnson. Carlton DeJam and Mark Williams will be suspended for a year. DeJam was facing expulsion. Attorney Lee Hutton said the student athletes are very disappointed by the panel's rulings and are exploring their options in consultation with their families. Four other players, Seth Green, Kobe McCrary, Antonio Chenault, and Antoine Winfield Jr. were cleared. Kobe McCrary tweeted, blessed man, ready to get back at it with my boys. Their attorney said they were pleased to be vindicated by the rulings and that the allegations against them were unwarranted. This began in September when a female student reported she was sexually attacked by several men in an off-campus apartment. The allegations range from those who had sexual contact with her to those who witnessed and encouraged it. You'll remember the case eventually led to the firing of head coach Tracy Clays. Clays tweeted support for his team when the players announced a temporary boycott after the 10 players were suspended. And this doesn't end here. Everyone involved has five days to notify the university if they will appeal the decision. A U spokesperson said it can't comment at this point because of privacy laws. Liz. We'll continue to follow it. Thank you, Jennifer.